Hey guys, it's uh, Thursday, I believe, and um, this video comes very late because I'm really lazy and I have a lot of projects to do for school, so I'm doing this at the last minute and trying to get it out of the way. But don't think that I'm being too lazy to do this. So, yeah. So, I've been trying to figure out which memory I really want to talk about, and with the whole theme of it all, I wanted to kind of just discuss. I have a pretty good memory, and especially when, when things that I um, have a cut on my tongue, so it's going to be really hard for me to talk. But um, I wanted to talk about a memory, a particular memory of how I really started jumping into um, community. Um, I, I don't want to put like an, another word around it because it wasn't just one particular theme and whatnot. I mean, there, it was one particular community that got me up and running, but uh, I wanted to just jump into those particu that particular memory. Um, and that particular memory was how I kind of got into Harry Potter. Um, I got into Harry Potter pretty late. It was around the fourth movie, not the fourth book. Um, the sixth book was had just come out uh, that summer, and I still owned them all. I just had never read th read them. Um, I had never read them because of all the hullabaloo about like everything that was against them, and um, all these different groups of peoples, and like clash of cultures and clash of religions against what the book was talking about. So I really didn't want to get into it that much. Not to mention, I wasn't really into young adult fiction as much as everybody else was. So. When I got into it, um, it was actually around the time when uh, I had just turned six, seventeen, I think, and my brother and his girlfriend, um, they always had to use me as a third wheel because um, they technically needed like a chaperone of some sort, and so I went with them to the movies. Um, well, because I had been going out with them for a long time, uh, I kind of decided I'm like, you know what, I don't want to watch the movie that they want to watch. They can go by themselves. And I was going to go watch another movie. And by mere chance, Harry Potter and the Cobbler of Fire was actually in theaters. So I decided that while they were watching their movie, I would go and watch that movie. Because there was nothing really else I was interested in um, of, of watching that was playing. Um, and I had never seen it. And I was like, okay, let me just go ahead and try it out. So I went to watch it. And about halfway through the movie, my brother and his girlfriend come into the theater telling me, our movie is over, we need to go. Uh, and basically because I was their ride and they didn't have a car. So I was like, alright, um, but I'm coming back tomorrow to finish watching this movie because it was really good. And the rest is history. Um, most of my friends already know me. Um, basically, the group of people that or every person that I've ever met kind of knows me for my fanaticism with Harry Potter and everything of that nature. And that was basically like that major memory that kind of like broke me into the rest of the community. Um, from there, I kind of jumped into Nerd Fighters um, right around the same time that I like started getting involved with the Harry Potter Alliance um, and everything from there on. Um, but yeah, like that particular memory kind of like shaped the person I am today because uh, it kind of like started sprouting a little bit more creativity over what I was interested in and I don't know it was just I really don't have much time to talk about any other memories but that was a, that particular memory I wanted to get out there so um, again today's Thursday yes tomorrow's Friday duh oh awesome so I'll, tomorrow I'll see you Ryan and everyone else I'll see you guys next week bye